Okay. Guys, you just close your eyes. You can wash it off in the ocean after it feels better, <laughs> but it, I'm gonna work it out. All right, good morning, guys. Um, I just got to start off by showing you Ender's outfit today. Ender, show me your outfit. <laughs> I saw that at the PCC yesterday, and I couldn't resist. It was the cutest thing. If they had a shorts shirt matching combo for me, I probably would have got it. They didn't have that, so I just had to sell a one for Ender. Hi, Ender. You're not the daddy. Yeah. I'm the daddy. <laughs> Oh, you guys, if we found the new tahine, the Hawaiian tahine, this stuff. I asked the guy where it was, and he, I said, you put it on like pineapple, right? That's the right stuff. And he's like, oh, you put it on everything. That stuff is magical. Okay, guys, we're in the middle of filming superhero videos. This happened. We convinced the people we brought with us, Josiah and Charlotte, to dress up silly like us. You guys are good sports. You guys are for real. Pirate scene going down. That is a for real pirate chest. Oh, real. <laughs> oh, no. What do you got there, Ender? Is that a pirate sword? Oh, hey! I thought you were a good guy. You a bad guy? No, you're too cute to be a bad guy. I know, I pirate. You're a pirate? Oh, not the camera, no! <laughs> oh, relaxing by the ocean. And then there's Ender. We're dying on his outfit. I'm so glad I bought that. The best money we ever spent right there. <laughs> the chubby little tourist. Oh, you got an iPad connected. Oh. <laughs> Ender, can you show us your new outfit? Do you like it? Nice, huh? Come lay with Say oh, aloha. Aloha. Say mahalo. <laughs> oh my gosh, he's so funny. Then we got little Edie right here. She's just eating her hands. I am not going to be surprised if teeth pop out of her gums any day now. I can't see him or anything, but she's just always biting on stuff. Dunkered out. We are going to go check out this beach that all the locals are telling us we have to go to because we've been asking where to boogie board and it's called Pounders Beach. It's called that because you get pounded, pounded by the into ocean. the beach. They said it's not straight for little kids, but the kids are all beached out anyway, so I don't think they're going to want to get in. It's an adult only. I'm thinking that they're just going to like put their feet in the water or run away from it. You're good. You guys just gonna sit here and write about your trip so far in your diaries? Well, we are, we're all playing a little connect dot to dot. Game. Oh, fun. Yeah. Got a sleeping baby there, and the breeze is keeping her cool in the shade. And we got Ender playing over here in the ocean. So, this is the Pounders Beach, and you can see over there all of the surfers. There's all the surfing people. Now this sand is a lot softer than the sand over on the, the beach. And the waves are a lot crazier. I'm guessing that's why. I guess it makes it more fine. And that's more coral over there. So. Is that fun? Found another jellyfish right here. It was they're dead. They washed up on the shore. It's crazy to see so much like things I'd never thought I'd see. I never thought I'd just see a jellyfish washed up on the shore. It's crazy. I think there's another one. Oh yeah, this one has long tentacles all the way straight down there. Nobody's gotten stung by one yet. They're like everywhere. I don't I don't know how this works. Maybe I'm speaking too soon. Jellyfish. Does anyone 
one though? Can they sting you even when they're dead, like like bees? I don't know. jellyfish. Do you want daddy to pee on your leg? It helps it. It helps. <laughs> it's the only thing that helps. Daisy. I gotta go get Daisy to pee on her leg. Crap. I was speaking too soon. Daisy! Daisy got stung by a jellyfish! Daisy got stung by a jellyfish! You just close your eyes. You can wash it off in the ocean after okay. it feels better. Give but me a it minute. I'm gonna work it up. <laughs> Give me a minute. Lay down on your stomach. Hurry. Where is it? Where's the owie? <laughs> All over there. Did I really feel it? Yes. Does it feel better? No. Let me go number two. No! <laughs> I'm gonna Google what to do. I don't. I really don't know. Carry her up there and we can Should Google we it. Should we soak her in the water? She's got me on it. Yeah, maybe wash off the pee if the pee didn't help. Oh. <laughs> Peeing on jellyfish sting does nothing. I was just, there was like three on the beach and I was like, where are all these coming from? How come nobody's and gotten stung better, yet? No, it doesn't. Oh. Our trip is ruined. I think it feels better. Look at those welts, sweetie. Oh, I'm so sad. What? What? It's the squid. I know. I can see it. So, I looked up online and Davy took Ender because I didn't, I couldn't watch him. But online it said to soak in vinegar or a baking soda mix and rinse, like rinse with salt water, which we did. We peed on it, we rinsed it with salt water, it's still burning, so he's going to get the vinegar and the baking soda. After trying those, it says soak in hot water for 20 minutes. I don't know how we're gonna do that. That's not available. And then you can use cold packs after. So we're just trying to get this sting under control. Is it hurting really bad? I'm so sorry. This is no laughing matter. I've been hurting her for like five minutes. I don't know. It really hurts though. Is it like a burn? Yeah. I'm so sorry. So I looked online and everything said like deactivate the tentacles and like scrape it with a credit card. And so I started thinking. Maybe it is like these. Yeah. I was started thinking maybe it is like these, like there's maybe part of the tentacle that sticks under the skin, because like removing it with a credit card, it just sounded like a bee sting to me. So I started looking really close, and there was these little blue hair-like slivers in her skin. Like over every welt was like a little hairy looking sliver, like a blue one. So I just kind of dipped my fingernail because I have really sh long fingernails right now and I just ran that across the top and sure enough the little hairs came out and I think I got them all. Is it starting to feel better? A little bit. Davey's back. He's got some vinegar. Cashier was like, are you making a volcano? I was like, no, my daughter got stung by a jellyfish. What'd she say? Is that the right thing to do? She was white. She didn't know. She was like, oh, okay. <laughs> Is it getting better, sweetheart? Yeah, but... It Yeah, it feels better. So a nice guy on the beach stopped and he's like, oh yeah, I've been stung before, but it was in Mexico. It was probably a different time and it was really big. It like covered half of his leg. And I looked online and it said, if it's covering more than half of your leg, you should go to the hospital. 
But this is like maybe two spot. It looks like two different jellyfish, like smaller ones did it, but it could have been one. I don't know anything. But it's like one lower and then one higher. And it's even with them combined, it's only like a third of her leg. So, and I'm also watching her very closely to see if she's going in the anaphylactic shock, which I don't think she is. And so, yeah, that's what he told us to watch. He's like, just make sure she stays coherent and knows where she is. And if she gets worse pain or if anything gets worse, then go to the doctor. But she's getting better. And so if things keep staying like this and getting better, then we won't worry about it. We'll just give her lots of treats and hugs and kisses, right? Were you mad when dad peed on your leg? Yes. <laughs> Is it kind of funny now? No. <laughs> Daisy, dad peed, I think are you feeling better, dead. sweetie? Daisy, are you feeling better? Yep. 100%? Uh, 100%. <laughs> Good. <sighs> Before we even left, it's been probably 30 minutes since it happened. She says she feels 100% again, so we must have done things right. <laughs> that was crazy though. I didn't know what to do. And I'm not laughing because I think it's funny. I don't think it's funny, but I'm more laughing at how scared it was. Like I laugh when I get really scared because I don't want to cry. And how ironic it was that I was like, Oh no, I'm getting done by an idiot. Just the kind of the whole situation now that it's over and everyone's fine is kind of funny. Oh my heck, you guys, that was crazy times. Poor little Daisy. Let me just tell you, I'm glad Daisy's not allergic to them and I'm glad it wasn't a very bad sting. Yeah. And I'm gonna go get her a bath, a hot bath right now. We're gonna end the vlog now. We're gonna go get some dinner and get the kiddos in bed. That was a crazy fun day. I got some good footage. It's so what, sad too. Boogie boarding. Those were the coolest you know waves I've ever been on. I was like selfieing it out there. It was awesome. Okay, I'm just gonna say right now, I'm a little sad because my favorite moment when I felt like I was like, this is it. This is the moment in the trip where I'm just like, my kids are having these amazing experiences. I was like tearing up. I'm out there flying. And then boom, jellyfish. She goes, oh, and I was like, I knew immediately because I'd been seeing her on the page and I was just like, no, I don't, she's never going to get in the but water. But you had that moment. At least you had that moment. But she did get an experience, even though it was a sad one. She knows what it feels like to be stung by a jellyfish now. <laughs> All right. Good night, guys. We'll see you tomorrow. That's true. <laughs>